Hello everybody, <laughs> welcome to a new vlog. Uh, it's a new year, 2022. Hope you had a great celebration yesterday. Now we're on our way to the skate park. Uh, we're gonna skate, or I'm gonna skate. And what a better, what a better way to start the new year than skating. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, see you in the skate park. finished skating and of course uh, now the sun is shining but while I was filming it was a little bit cloudy it's been cloudy for the last couple of days because it's so hot during the day and during the night it gets so cold so it's this uh, dimma how the fuck do you say that in English anyway it's it's like clouds everywhere and it's like this watery uh, wet air you probably know what I'm talking about and I know I can't skate like I did before and I'm doing my best and to be honest I'm so fucking proud of myself for even doing top sole top porn, alley -oop top porn, I, I made a sole down on the curb I haven't even, you know, I couldn't even think about make a fucking grind before and now I can and, and I'm kind of still very very stiff in my back it still hurts so I need to quit now for example I felt like okay I can't skate anymore so I will answer because I get so many questions on my Instagram like how come you're not skating how come you don't skate anymore why you don't skate anymore what's happening with your back what's wrong with your back um, how can you be injured so long blah 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 I get questions every day and I try to answer them all but I will answer now for everybody that sees this. Okay, so the thing with my back, I got injured. Good job, yeah, you're there. Hello. Um, two years ago, I was in Malaga Skate Park and I was skating, that was after quarantine. Here it was like quarantine for six months. So for six months, I didn't go out, I didn't work out, I didn't take walks, I didn't skate, I didn't go to the gym or anything. That made my back weak and because you couldn't do anything, I was drinking a lot of wine. I didn't sleep properly and also here in um, Spain they have shitty beds, shitty fucking beds. So since I moved here I started to get this back problem slowly, slowly, slowly. But then in the skate park two years ago something just happened and I couldn't, after that I couldn't sit, I couldn't sleep, it was terrible. 
I went to a chiropractor, she gave me like um, some exercises and after six months it disappeared but then after like two months after it came back so I had this injury for two years but I've been able to skate like two months after I got the first injury since I got injury number two it, now some people are looking at me but I don't I don't care uh, I got it back and this time it hurt so fucking much so since that day I haven't been able to to sit down more than like one minute I I was crying when I went out in the car and the problem with my back is that in my lower back I have broken discs so my discs are leaking I don't know even if, if a disc is the English word it's it's a Swedish word but probably you know what I mean it's leaking and the 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 thing that is leaking is going to some nerves in my back so like my whole lower back hurt as a motherfucker so I haven't been able to skate for like one and a half year now uh, and yeah that's it so this is the reason to why I've been doing a lot of exercises I've been going to the gym and because of this I also had a physiotherapist that was helping me after I went to a chiropractor three times Naprapat two times and then I went to Sweden and I met a personal trainer that is also a physiotherapist and after she helped me she said you can't do an operation you can't uh, just sleep it off or walk it off you have to strengthen your back and that you have to do slowly first so I have a video about this how you get rid of this with exercise at home and then I met another one at the gym with heavy more heavy weights and stuff that is the only way to get rid of this lower back problem is to work out because if you get this means you have uh, like you you have a weak back so I'm getting my strength back and as you see for you that have been following me know that I had only I could only like go forwards I could maybe make a shitty backside but now I can do a sole a top sole a top or and I I can slowly come back on on my grinds so I'm very very happy from not be able to walk out of the car without crying and being on bad mood every day because I haven't slept enough and you know come to be walking around with constantly pain like if I'm working on my computer I have to stand up and if I sit down I only do it for like five minutes at a time because it's, it's like the worst thing you can have for some people you it disappear but some people have this for the rest of their life so what I can do is to continue workout continue strength my back because if I will have this pain for the rest of my life at least I reduce the pain by working out so for you that think that I don't skate as good as I did before now you have the answer but I'm working my fucking ass off to be able to skate like I did before anyway I don't know what to do today I'm in Fönkerola I will go to Puerto Banos to uh, buy some nutrition food for Guchebel because she she don't eat that well now because she just had her period so I'm gonna be nice to her and buy food that she love and after that I have to go to Correos to mail some shit and I don't look forward for that because Spanish they are very slow and you have to stand in a line forever but I have to do it so yeah let's go to Puerto Banos